All right, basically, I decided to do a small video, a very small one, in order to reactivate something I did a while back on my pro on my Facebook profile that I wanted to challenge people, you know? Basically, this is what I did. I posted a picture that I found on um, Facebook. <clears throat> I'm sorry for my voice a little. It's still trying to recuperate. I'll explain that on another video. Anyways, <clears throat> now I did what you what I would now call a picture challenge. Okay, I post a picture on a video or actual Facebook without the talking, and then basically what I'm going to do in regards to this picture is that I'm going to ask you to challenge challenge me. Okay, now I don't know how many of these actual these kind of videos I'm going to do, but we're gonna give this one a try and see how it is now basically I'm gonna post up a picture and it's gonna have a few words I'm gonna read them out loud and I'm going and this and I'm also gonna describe the challenge okay basically this first challenge okay involves a lot of favorite characters that people have in store basically um you know um well, let's just put it. Let's let me put up the picture, and you're gonna see all these characters. Now, keep in mind these pic these characters have prices on them. Okay, the number that you see is the price that they are valued by, not about because of what they are, mostly because of how people think about, like you know, like say if you had to purchase something, how mo how valuable could it really be, you know? But remember this: there's a limit. Now here, here's the picture. Now, as far as you can see, and I'm hoping you can still hear me, you know, this says that the spending limit of two thousand dollars. Okay, that's all you get, two thousand dollars. Choose your allies wisely. You're going to war with another country. Ooh, this sounds interesting. Who is your team? All right, now. I'm going to leave this picture on for now so I can explain it little by little what so you can have a visual sense, okay? Now, my team, okay? My team comprised of only four different characters. But you think that these four characters might not be much, but compared to Goku on on the top uh, left there and Superman on the top right. No. Okay. For one, the spending limit is only two thousand dollars, right? Okay. Now Goku and Superman are about the most expensive thing up there. Okay. So this is what I did. If you hear something in the background, I uh, I'm explain that in another video. Okay. Now this is what I did. I took the prices into consideration. Not all of not all of them are high priced. Okay. I see Super Mario and uh, let's see uh, Batman are only two hundred dollars each. Okay, and and um, Master Chief there is about three hundred. So basically, this is what I did. I took not only to their prices but their abilities. Okay, okay. Now Charizard right there is a very good firepower, but remember this: he's not a he's not actually a dragon. He's only a fire type, and Hulk. Oh yeah, Hulk can smash through almost everything, but the thing is, what kind of control does he have? Really? Honestly. And and Sonic, he can run fast. That's great. But what kind of powers uh, without does he have without the the other uh, emeralds, you know? Really? They, they don't show Super Sonic, they just show Sonic. So keep that into mind that they're they're not asking you what kind of Sonic they are. And as far as uh, the uh, four Ninja Turtles there, okay, uh, more manpower is great, but don't c just consider the numbers, okay? Now, here's what I did. My first choice was Naruto. Now, why? Basically, Naruto has the Rasengan, right? But what? why would I choose Naruto out of all the characters? I could have chose Goku. Especially since he has God Mode. Or Superman, which bu bullets fly off of him like nothing. Okay? 
The fact is, Goku may be a strong, strong-ass fighter, especially when he's in God mode, but he's as dumb as a rock. Most of the time, he just considers, he just thinks about fighting and eating. I'm, I'm even surprised that he remembers his son's name. Or his own. And as far as Superman, there's one problem with Superman. One simple problem. He is as strong as steel. He flies like so fast. He got laser eyes and he's basically invincible, right? Wrong. You could take out a piece of kryptonite, which apparently is plentiful on Earth somehow. And he he's as weak as a newborn baby. Okay? So if both... For, so to a, any of you that consider Goku and Superman stronger than Naruto, well, just remember those facts about what I just said about both of them. Okay? Now, the reason Naruto, I put Naruto first is because here's one thing. Manpower. What did I say about manpower with Ninja Turtles? They have four of them. But what can Naruto do? He's got the Shadow Clone Jutsu. Okay? He can make multiple, millions of copies of himself if he had enough chakra. And boom! You have an, you have your own army right there. It's already $800 and it's I already have an army. Okay? All I need is him and he makes himself copies of himself. And with the Rasengan and all those other powers he's learned throughout the day, and Sage Mode, pff, please, I'd choose him in a heartbeat right now. Okay? Now, my second choice was more powerful. It doesn't have to be more copies, just more powerful. Okay? I chose Cloud, which is 800. By the way, remember that Minaruto is 800 and Cloud is 800. Those are the about the, let's see, third biggest nu numbers there, okay? 800. Now that's about $1,600, right? I'm almost at my limit already. So I needed about $400 more, right? Okay, Cloud, he has his Omni Slash. He can basically take out several swords at once from his one uh, big ass sword right there that he has in his back. Unless, well, that means that's his soldier sword, but if you choose his other form with the multiple swords in one, one build, basically he's invincible. Okay? All he has to do is pull it out, boom, you're dead. Okay? Especially in, Cla in Smash Brothers. They made him so broken that I basically keep winning with him. And I barely know how to fight in Smash Brothers. Okay? Or s other fighting games. Okay? Now, the last two. Okay? I got about, what, $400 left. And basically, uh, I'm trying to uh, reach the limit of 200 I mean, 2000 I mean. Well... This wasn't a hard choice, to be honest. It's not even that hard, okay? Yes, there's uh, Sonic for 500, but then it goes over. So is uh, Ninja Turtles. Now, uh, Master Chief is about 300, but then I need at least 100 more, and there's no nobody here with $100, uh, okay? So I decided to go a little cheaper, about $100 less than Master Chief or Charizard, and about $200 less than, than Sonic. Now, why? What? Who would I choose here? Uh, yeah. There's. Oh, don't forget. There's Spider-Man up there. By the way, a lot of people forget about him. Okay. Who's worth four hundred dollars? Okay. There's two characters left in there that's worth four hundred dollars. In but together. Does anybody see them? If you guessed. Super Mario and Batman, yes, those are my characters. Those are my last two characters. Now, why would I choose Super Mario? Whenever you play uh, the old school Mario games, basically, there's one particular power that he picks up throughout the game several times that he can actually basically kill any almost anything, you know? He'll probably even defeat Bowser within five times touching him. Super Mario can activate his star power, okay, which makes him invincible for a couple, for a few seconds, and then basically you bum rush everything in the game, even Bowser if you could, okay, and that's why I choose him because he can become invincible just for a few seconds, and all that's all. Sometimes that's all you need to get ahead. 
Now, explain to me why I would want Batman. Okay, he has no superpowers. He has no special abilities. And basically, his uh, gadgets are, well, well, they're great. They're per perfect to replace superpowers, but, you know, they're still not superpowers. Now, why would I choose him? Here's the simple reason. What the hell does Batman have above everybody else here in, the, in this setup? Okay? He's the smartest character that I've ever known to be able to beat even Superman himself. And all he has to do is pull out a piece of kryptonite for him. Okay? That's all Batman has to do. And he keeps one, a piece of that, in his belt. And considering that Super uh, Bat, uh, Goku is as dumb as rocks when in most cases, even though he's a god, god mode. Do you think that Batman can really lose to a guy who thinks uh, a bowl of ramen or whatever is more and fight and kung fu is more f important than family? Please, Batman lost his mom and dad, which forced him to work harder. Okay, basically. He can lead this team into victory every single time, okay? Naruto, he just tells Naruto to make several copies of himself. He orders Cloud to stand in the ready. Super Mario as the last resort for an invincible mode, and then him leading the whole damn thing into victory, okay? Now, if you all chose a lot, a few other different characters to, to limit to $2,000, well, think about this, what I said, okay? Master Chief, Goku, Spider-Man, Superman, Hulk, Charizard, Sonic, and hell, even Ninja Turtles. They're all great characters, but those four characters basically make up the most broken, kick-ass, badass team that I've ever known in my life, okay? Now, I'm going to take this off so I can go back to the camera. Now that's my team, okay? That's my team, okay? If you guys disagree, I dare you to do better, okay? Like I said, Naruto's Nar Shadow Clone makes our army already. Um, Cloud's so super powerful compared to all the other characters that I chose. Super Mario is invincible for a couple seconds, which sometimes is all you need when when it came to the game and Batman leading the entire team he doesn't even need to fight he just has his intellect to lead this whole team imagine the possibilities with this team okay and like I said if you think any different then I dare you to challenge me this is the picture challenge of this video the first and and foremost hopefully more to come of this video is challenge me okay this is my team deal with it dale